Hey, what's up guys? Welcome to Clown Vapes. Uh, here for another video. Uh, yeah, let's jump into it. We're going to do a nice quick and dirty review on this guy right here. Let's see, what is it? The Zero. It's upside down. So yeah, the Zero Pod. And I will say for now, get one. Just spoilers, just get one. You will not regret it. All right, so let's jump on the top down view, give a little closer view, a little idea of what this guy is and yeah so let's do it all right guys so here it is uh this is the zero pod system now we got the zero a new beginning this is the pod itself what it looks like i'm guessing this is how they do their color indication uh i haven't seen a different boxes so i wouldn't know what to tell you at that point on this side it says Renove, created by Vapresso. Thing on that box. And here it says Omniboard, press to fill system, quick charging system, C cell coil built in. And I will show you that when we get to that point. Uh, then we got your UPC code, you know, the batch number, what batch it came from, all your basic like don't throw away in their can, all that kind of thing. Uh, all their social media info keep out of reach of children and minors manufacturing like information right here then we got your specifications of it like you know 6500 mah battery or 650 mah battery 0.1 ohm or 1.1.0 1 ohm coil uh, coil in there it's a 2 mil capacity then here it says what you have in there which is like a pod the the pod system itself, a charging cable, and an easy fill bottle. And then you know some basic info on here. All right, let's let's get to to opening this guy up. So here we go. And there it is, the uh, zero pod. As you can tell uh, this is the one I've been using. The pod itself. I do have extras, but here let me show you guys. Let me finish showing you guys the packaging. You take this guy out, and here you got your. All your basic stuff charging cable there's that easy fill bottle with like their uh, their instructions on how it works and all that kind of thing which is kind of nice and you could just use this bottle or use whatever bottle you have uh, from I can tell uh, like unicorn style bottles or gorilla ch chubby gorilla style bottles will work and uh, I don't think Sriracha style bottles will work, but you know, I'll get to that here in a bit. You got your basic um, fill information right here. Let's you know how long it takes to like, you know, have the juice soak and all that kind of thing. And here it says uh, what ratios of it'll take. So it'll take a 50, 50 or a 30, 70. So most likely nothing higher. I don't recommend it. If you guys don't want to like mess up your coil or that kind of thing. And you got your instruction booklet, which it's a nice little little doohickey here. It's got all your info and several languages and that kind of thing. So it's got a little bit for everybody, even Chinese. All right. And lastly, within the packaging, you get your uh, you get your warranty card and a warning card. So. That's all that comes in the packaging, which is not, I mean, not terrible on the packaging. It's not like you're overloaded with a bunch of stuff. Let me move all this out of the way. And I'll show you guys the, uh, the, the zero Renovo pod. All right. So I've been using, uh, country clouds, cornbread pudding in here. So use like, there's two magnets in here. You can see them in there. They go along with these magnets in here, and this thing just pops right in. Magnets are pretty nice and strong, so it doesn't really pop out really easily. All right, to turn it on, you just do uh, five clicks right here on the button. You'll see that light come on. Then uh, when you buy it, it comes in a default green, and the green is the highest setting you get, which is 12 watts. Then it drops to 10 and then 9. 
depending on which setting you want it, if you just click here three times, one, two, three, it changes to blue. And at that point you're doing 10 watts, then you do one, two, three, and it drops to red, and that is nine watts right there. So depending on which setting, uh, what style of ape you want or that kind of thing, uh, it'll make a difference on which setting you want it. Personally, I've been enjoying the green. Uh, the other two settings are a little too low for me, but then again, I'm just not good at the whole mouth to lung thing. And this kind of accommodates for it a little bit, which is kind of nice. So let me show you how to fill it real quick. What you do is you get your bottle. And you see this right here, you just push down on it and then you start squeezing at your e-liquid and then your pot will start filling up and that kind of thing. I guess that was a lot more full than I thought. I don't know. Let's see. So you just push that down, squeeze on your e-liquid. And there you go. It's nice and full. You just pop that guy back on there and you're ready to go. I mean, it's a very simple system, not a whole lot to it. And I personally have been enjoying it. I've been using it for the last two or so weeks and this guy has not left my pocket. It's become one of my on the go pods. And honestly, like I enjoy a couple other ones that I do have, but this guy has become a nice replacement for that. And I haven't been enjoying it. All right. So I'm gonna give you guys my final thoughts. Um, any more, I, any more things that I could come up with to let you guys in on. And yeah, so I'll catch you guys up top and we'll, we'll, we'll have a, a nice little final thoughts on it. Awesome. All right, guys. So that is a close look at the zero pod. And I will say, as I said at the intro of this video, get one. Just, I mean, Seriously, if you're looking for a nice pod system, something simple to use, get one. Uh, charging is really simple. The cable it comes with it is nice and sturdy. Honestly, I like it. The pods are nice. The mouthpiece is very comfortable, very uh, easy to use. Just simple. Very, very simple. I mean, there's not. it's a pod system. There's not a whole lot you can say about it. There's not a whole lot that can go wrong, which is... One of those things that if you're trying to get uh, a new a new vapor going, you know, something to start on, something to, you know, get their feet wet. How about that? I, this is one of those top ones I would recommend. I have a couple of other pod systems. I mean, I have that one that we not speak of because seriously, I don't care for their products all that much anymore. After certain things that have gone down, uh, I have the uh, the Soren Air, which this is a good one. But I mean, it's kind of like... In vaping terms, it's become a little antiquated. Uh, it is a nice little starter setup, but again, antiquated. Then I also have the uh, also the Mi Pod, which I enjoy these. But again, they're just like there's systems that you have to have a certain thing you're looking for. And this one, with the options of being able to change the temperature or the wattage, I guess it really does help. I mean, let's see it right now. I have it on green, right? So we go one, two, three. Now it's on blue. And I mean you just saw the cloud production I had from the uh, from the green. Here's a hit on the blue. It's relatively the same, but it has a little bit more of a tighter draw just from the dropping of the coil. So it's really, really nice. Uh if you you know, you could actually grow a little bit with it. Here I'm trying to put it on red. Okay, now we have it on red, which is like a 9 watt kind of dealy. It's a tighter draw because it doesn't really, it doesn't do, uh, it's not as warm. It's warm, but it doesn't have as much output. So I feel that this is a very nice starter pod system for somebody that is looking to get into vaping, that is trying to get off cigarettes. And that has it has that multiple option of you could turn it up, turn it down to whatever setting you like if you're looking for a mouth to lung or even like a restricted direct lung. And it has options. I mean, that board is really nice. Uh, 
I haven't come across this because personally, I don't really let it go dry. But a couple of my buddies that have this, they have they've said that if this thing starts going dry, it kind of knows and it doesn't let you pull as hard from it. You know, battery life is insane. Uh, what I think I've gone like three, four days without having to charge this and using it just completely. I mean, I have all my other vape gear that I use, but this thing has been just on complete use since I got it. it has been nice. I forgot to mention on the top down view, these are the coil heads. Or the coils that come with it, the pods, the coils, the pods, code, coils and pods, they come two to a pack like that. So you could get, you know, some extras. I would recommend, I mean, from what I can tell the life, I mean, I've had this for over a week and a half and I'm still using the same pod. So the pods will last you for quite a bit. And even then, these are like, I think uh, they're like $10 for the two pack. I'm not sure, but if. I should have probably uh, re-looked that up because it's been a while since I've had these. So if you're actually looking for something that has some life and things like that, it's really, really nice. I am enjoying it and I do recommend it. I seriously put it on one of my newbies top recommendations. So yeah, that is, that has been the, uh, that has been the zero pod. Like I said, it was going to be a quick and dirty review. Just get my feet wet into doing just uh solo review videos as I'm, sit on the uh, vlog this week i'm trying to separate out both entities into their own thing and it just gives me more 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 to put out for you guys you know if you're enjoying the videos you know thank you for support and all that kind of thing and all that so as always vape on mix on All right, let's do this. Recording time. All right. I don't even know why I did that, but sure.